All right, what's up everybody? This is TJ Customs and I'm back. And today I'm going on a hunt. Um, I'm gonna try to vlog as much as I can. I'm gonna show as much as I can. Uh, I have a couple clips and I'm gonna try to do as much as I can. But yeah, I'm going and I'm gonna try to find a bunch of the new stuff that's coming out. So yeah, a friend's coming with me. So I'm gonna try to film, but sometimes I get a little uncomfortable. But yeah, I'm gonna try to film for you guys and upload this ASAP so that I can keep getting uh, content out to you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed the rest of the video um, and I will see you guys soon. Always the driest of dries, man. I'm telling you. This is my local one. I'm going to more though. Dang. Okay guys, so first off, I want to apologize because I did not videotape enough when I went on and I'm really upset about it. So this video isn't going to come out as soon as I wanted it to. I'm going to have to wait until I get a little bit more footage because uh, I don't like uploading a two minute video. So anyway, I will show you what I got though. I didn't, like I said, I, I'll show some clips of uh, a little bit of what I was doing, but Again, I didn't get a lot of good clips, so I'm sorry about that, but this is the stuff that I ended up buying today. Got another X-Men Vintage Wave. Um, I didn't exactly really, really want this one, but I decided to get it. I actually wish I went back and got the Silver Samurai now. I did want that as well with this, and it was there, as well as Dazzler and a few of the other ones. I don't want every figure in this wave, by the way. I don't think I want the Iceman. I kind of do, but I don't want him because I'm satisfied with my Iceman. Dazzler, I do kind of want. And I also kind of want the Cyclops, but I can't decide. But I obviously I got the Storm. Uh, well, actually, you guys wouldn't know that. I did. I do have that Storm now. Uh, I have that Wolverine now, and I want the Silver Samurai. I think, but this is a very cool figure. Um, I finally got this. This is this because I saw it, and it was on clearance, as you can see. So I finally got this. So you know, I've wanted it for a while, just because it's like another cosmic character. It's another cosmic villain. Um, yep, that noise is me farting. <laughs> Um, and then I finally picked up Loki. I passed on him once because I wasn't an actual big fan of the figure, to be honest. I don't, I don't really like how it looks. I think he's a little bit too bulky and I'm not a huge fan of the face sculpts, but I got it anyway. He's going to go up with my cosmics for now. His eyes are a little weird as well, but yeah, that was my little haul for today. Um, you know, I wish it would have been more and more of the stuff I was actually looking for, which was the Iron Man, the 80th anniversary stuff and the Colossus and Juggernaut two pack, which I've seen twice in person and had to pass up on because I didn't have the funds for it. And today I had the funds for it and it wasn't there. <laughs> Yeah, guys, so I went back out bright and early in the morning today uh, because I wasn't really satisfied with the amount of footage I got for you guys yesterday, and I went out and I found this, which was really cool. Again, this is not exactly what I was looking for. Um, I had gotten a thing online saying that uh, the 80th anniversary Captain America uh, was in stock at my Walmart, so I went there, and of course it wasn't, and I asked, and of course it wasn't, so I don't know what that was all about. Anyway, I was able to cop this Scorpion finally. I haven't, I, you know, I haven't been able to get this guy because I, I held off on this wave and decided not to uh, get my pre-orders in. I figured I'd pick them up eventually, and now I have. I have both Hydro Man and Scorpion now. So yeah, I've seen Hydro Man a million times, and I actually paid more money for Hydro Man than I definitely should have because I got him from Big Bad Toy Store when he came out, and it cost like 30-something bucks with shipping and everything, and I definitely could have gotten him for 18 or, you know, around 20 plus tax with this. Um, at Walmart today, so you know, I could have gotten him at any point, but happy to have Scorpion. This looks like a pretty cool figure. I think I wish he was a little bit bulkier to be honest, but um, you know, he looks all right nonetheless. And he's gonna fit right into my uh Spider Man shelf somewhere <laughs> once I figure out where to put him, but yeah, I'm hyped that I got him, so hopefully, I can get a couple more figures today. If not, uh, at least I got something, so that's good. And yeah, I'm right outside of a Walgreens. I went to it, nothing. This Walgreens never has anything, man. Around me, where I live, literally every store that I go to has nothing. I swear, nothing ever. Uh, it, it's it's super shocking. It, it's super shocking to me if there actually is something. Um, but nah, man, there's nothing, nothing there. They had like four figures. Uh, yeah, and I don't, I don't ask because the last time... Ooh, I don't ask because the last time I asked, they basically told me, um, you know, they, they have no idea and they rarely get shipments of it in. And when they do, it's completely random as what they get. And I was like, oh, okay, that's how that works. All right. 
So Walgreens is a pretty like, you know, at least around here, man, you, they, you never know what they're going to have and they barely ever have anything as it is. So yeah, it's a struggle, man. It's a struggle. <laughs> All right, guys, so I went to GameStop. They didn't have what I wanted, of course, but I did, uh, as I talked about earlier in the video, I wanted this, so I got it. And then I also picked up this, which I didn't really want, but I'm gonna try to paint him up a little bit, give him some blue hues for you guys and see how that looks. So that's my plan, but um, yeah. So that's how that went. Um, I gotta hold off from buying some Legends for a little while, so. Uh, especially if I want to get that two pack, so I'm gonna have to wait another week or so before I buy any more stuff. But yeah, guys, it was a fun little, uh, fun little trip there. We're at the workbench. Holy crap! What is going on? So we're gonna try to add some blue to this guy. Um, I'm gonna take the other Iceman off the stand so I can get kind of a reference of how the blue should look. So but that's how we're gonna do it. We're gonna attempt to put some light blue hints into this guy to make him look even better than he, you know. I mean, he doesn't really look good, so we're gonna make him look really good, hopefully. All right, so here's the finished product. I've got him standing next to my Toy Biz one, which obviously is way more blue than what I did to this one, but you can kind of see I definitely added blue to him, and I definitely made him a lot more blue than he originally was, and I think it looks all right. It's like a, it's like a mix between the pearly color that he was and this light blue color. And I'm pretty happy with it. This one obviously is more like blue with like a dry brushing of like a silvery color, I guess, on it uh, with blue eyes and whatever else. I'm going to keep him like this. So I think that this looks okay. Um, and I obviously still love this Toy Biz one, but I wanted one with a more, uh, a better looking body mold to go along with the other Hasbro figures. So that's why I have this one here and not this Toy Biz one anymore. You know, I wanted to, I want, like I said, I wanted to have one that had just... Um, a body mold that sort of matched the other ones better. All right, guys, I decided for now I'm going to change up the X-Men display. So this is the last time you're going to see this display. So I'll show you guys and it's all its glory here. Uh, this is this is my X-Men display. Sorry for the bright light. Um, find the X-Men villains. So this is my X-Men display. I'm going to change it up here, guys. So um, I want to make it like my Avengers. Um... I don't know. I just, I just kind of just really want to. <laughs> so I'm going to. So yeah, uh, that's what I'm going to try to do. And uh, hopefully it'll look really good. If not, uh, maybe I'll go back to this. So we'll see. Hopefully it looks good though. Everything taken off. Guys, I have some extremely depressing news. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Other than something like I feel like couldn't be somehow fixed um, to where it's still workable. But for now, it's like this. I can't get a replacement because they're, she's just so expensive nowadays. Um, she's a super hard figure to get. So I'm going to figure out eventually how to get this back. Sorry about my nails. I'm going to figure out a way to eventually get this back on to where it is completely... Um, uh, like brand new, you know, so I'm sure that'll be a way I can do it But for now, that's how it is, but I usually have her in a flight pose anyway, so it shouldn't be too big of a deal So yeah, I got another package in the mail guys Finally, I'm able to get one of these Iron Men. Uh, I got one uh, Shipped to me Hopefully I'll be able to find the Thor and the Captain America soon enough But this is the one I wanted the most so I went out of my way to get it earlier than the other ones um, hopefully I can find the other ones at retail though, but yeah, I paid a little bit extra for them, just $10 extra, so not too bad. Very hype, looks very good, I'm super excited. Last little clip of the day, pickup of the day, it's August 15th, we gotta get the Avengers Endgame in the 4K, you know, can't wait to watch this, can't wait to watch the special features and stuff, I mean, remembering Stan Lee... Setting the tone, casting Robert Dunny Jr. Man of Time. I can't wait to watch all that stuff. That's going to be great. Journey to Endgame, all that stuff. Yeah, I'm very excited to watch all the special features. I'll probably go home and watch those. I'll probably watch them tonight. So I'm very excited to watch all that stuff. I like it. It's a very nice cover. The steel book looks like poop, though. Just saying. Anyway, guys. Got a nice new haircut. Um, I'm going to end the video here. I will upload it hopefully very soon. I'll edit it together. It's not extremely long, but hey, um, hopefully I'll be giving you guys a room tour slash collection update very soon, but I'm not quite sure about that yet. I'm in a McDonald's parking lot, about to get some grub. Um, but 
Thank you guys for tuning this video. I love the support I've been getting. Uh, it means a whole lot, honestly. I love the support I've been getting. I wanna thank everyone for that. And I'm gonna try to keep getting videos out. I'm sorry that they take weeks uh, to upload or to make. Sorry that I'm only uploading like one, uh, you know, every so often. I'm gonna try to get one out a week, but it might be a little bit more than that. I'm trying, I'm sorry. But um, yeah, thank you guys for the support and I will catch you guys in the next video. All right, peace.